You know, let's take a look at this uh, video. It's uh, about the uh, Ciji's effort in Myanmar. Um, okay, this video was uh, during the rainy season. Actually, many Ciji volunteers, they are victims too. So, the senior Ciji volunteer Li Jinglan paid a visit and uh, brought love and care to them. And so the this is a Ciji volunteer. She says that uh, uh, because of the the raining season. Uh, and uh, many area experience non-stop rainfall for hours, so they are stranded and hungry. So uh, she appreciated that uh, sister Li Jinglan's uh, visit and help. And now this is the next video. It was uh, in actually in Kaohsiung, Jingsiho. Uh, the dialogue section was a master Dharma master Zen Yan, and uh, uh, local volunteers from Myanmar came to Kaohsiung to meet the master Zen Yan in person and uh, show master Zen Yan the, the little dresses they make. And if you look at this video, actually it gave us a, a very positive energy because uh, uh, if you see the the elephant village, and it also talk about the the big flood in Myanmar, and the Li Jinan says that uh, the rice field were completely soaked, and then the residents were so poor that they have to live in the village where the elephants stay in the village too. Look at this is a the this is the house that the residents live in the village. So, so when Master Zhengyan was in Kaohsiung, the Ciji volunteer in Myanmar came to Kaohsiung to report the current situation in Myanmar. And then this is another video give us that uh, today, this year, there are eight local volunteers being certified as a Ciji commissioner. And uh, the main character on this video is uh, brother Wu Shan Ding, who is even 70 years old, and uh, he was uh, diagnosed with COVID-19, and he almost killed. And then this is another uh, uh, new uh, certified commissioner. So everyone, so he said that there are total five villages that accumulate uh, five years, spend five years, spend five years, and uh, to uh, reach to accomplish the two. So in the memoir, they donate one handful of rice. So this is a very touching story. And this is a brother, Wu Shan Ding. So Master Zeng always uh, expect and uh, encourage us that we have to stay with RI TV because we will learn a lot of things from RI TV. And uh, uh, Wu San Ding used to be the village, the village chief. And uh, uh, Master Zeng told him that do not be the village chief. And fortunately, he took Master Zhengyan's words and did not become the village chief because during the military coup, 
in Myanmar, many village chiefs were killed. So Wu Shanding was uh, very uh, grateful. So now let's uh, speak. Let's uh, let's say the password and to welcome speaker Li Jinglan. I'd like to stay with you because you have positive energies. So good day, uh, Sister Jinglan. Now you may start to do your sharing. So dear Dharma Master Zhengye, Masters, Masters at the Jing's upon everyone, Happy New Year. I'm very happy to join the online study group today to and grateful that uh, Master Zhengyan told us to practice the Lotus Sutra on the Bodhisattva path so that we can preach her teaching from Hualien to overseas. Myanmar is like uh, 2,700 kilometers away from Hualien. And the cyclone Nagis in 2008 opened up the affinity between Myanmar and the Ciji. So, because we are so poor, but uh, we donate one handful of rice. And during the... Okay, we have uh, some lake problem. So at, but from this poster, we can learn that uh, uh, Li Jingnan was going to tell us that uh, uh, during the re relief work, city volunteers shared the spirit of the bamboo coin bank, and uh, many people were inspired. And uh, even they don't have money to donate, they save a handful of rice and respect and uh, cherish the every grain of the rice just like the history of Ciji's Bam Coin Bank. So this is just like the Sutra, the infinite meaning of the Sutra told us that uh, uh, one seed can create many seeds and uh, uh, inspire millions and millions of people to do the good deed. So, So the ripple of the kindness was uh, fermented in the community. And, and not only change a person or a family's life, but also transform the whole village's life. And this picture is telling us that uh, it's one of the village in Yangang. And it's about more than 200 volunteers are waiting to be trained. And they are three have been certified as city commissioner in village. So this is just like what we have learned from infinite meaning of the sutra, that one seed can create millions of seed and two infinite seed. And it is all come from the belief in Master Zen Yan's preach and the trust in city. We follow Master Zen Yan's teaching and uphold our aspiration. After the after the harvest, people were not thinking about how to make more money, but think about how to help more other people in poor village. One of which is the elephant village. In the remote area, it was originally set up as an elephant elephant protection area because some people were so poor they don't have other place to live they stay in this place and the distribution of solar panels to the village was one of the support projects since 2015 and the picture was showing the solar panels distribution in October of 2023 so many of the res really really religion many of the residents in elephant village have no land no food and a few opportunities to work their house their houses are almost empty however 
they are compassionate, and then they would like to help others. So even they live in a difficult environment, they have to thought about how to help other poor people. So during the distribution, some of the people they ask for three piggy banks, one for the charity purpose, another one is for fundraising collection, the other one is for their child to teach him to do the good deed as well. And when we walk to the elephant village, we have to choose the hottest time of the day. Because the elephant will not show up for fear of heat, but uh, but actually we can find the elephant's footprints everywhere. Many villagers were so frightened, and their houses have been destroyed by elephant many times. So they simply just build their house on trees. So one family was so excited to see Ziji volunteer, and they told us their house had been destroyed by elephants more than four to five times. Gratitude, and the wife said that the master Zhenyin have saved their life because of the elephant for many years. Elephants are actually afraid of the light. But the residents do not have ability to buy the candles. So at night, when elephants approach to them, they have to hurry up and throw the torches to drive them away. But it was really scary. With the solar panels, they hand the light light bulbs out, and the elephant won't approach. Right. And now,、uh, the residents eventually they can sleep soundly. So as soon as they receive the solar panels, they install the panels immediately. And at night, night, more than twenty elephants enter the village, and because the whole village was so bright, the elephants walk away. So people did appreciate Master Zhenyin's wisdom and Miss、uh, Master Zhenyin's love. And one day, a woman couldn't come to pick up the solar panel that、uh, Zhiji distributed because suddenly she felt painful and was about the time to give the birth. So later on, they they gave the child's name after Zhiji. Because he was born at the date of、uh, the distribution of Zizi, that was the day start to change their life. Everyone cherished the solar energy panel given by Zizi. I was very grateful today that I have this opportunity to share this story. Thank you for everyone's love and support to us. So thank you for your wonderful sharing. And actually, during the sharing, actually we learned the meaning of the meaning of the the work actually was ongoing project. And、uh, this is a very diligent uh, Zizi volunteers, and、uh, they keep the promoting the and the one came for rice piggy bank and inspire. And recruit so many volunteers to join Ziji and to be certified as a Ziji commission. So, like a Canada、uh, sister, she responds, give us a feedback. She said, like the one、uh, handful of rice, one handful of rice is very inspiring. And hopefully, we can、uh, invite more people to join Ziji family and preach Master Zhenyin's teaching. And another、uh, another volunteer from Bingchen, she said that、uh, Wu Shanding took Master Zhenyin's word and did not be the village chief. So we have to listen to、uh, Dharma Master Zhenyin's teaching and be a good disciple. Took Master Zhenyin's word. And in Malaysia. 
in Malaysia, Ziji volunteer in Malaysia also they、uh, listen to Master Zeng Yin's preach, and they follow Master Zeng Yin's step. So it's really grateful. And in Tainan, someone said that、uh, helping people is not a privilege for the rich people, but it's the privilege for those who has a sincere heart. Thank you for Master Zeng Yin's preach. So be a good disciple. And then、uh, someone said that it's a very beautiful little dress. So we see the sufferings and we learn the suffering, and then we cultivate and、uh, cultivate and do the good deed to cultivate our own blessing. So your feedback、uh, is very encouraging and motivate motivated. So, so thank you, thank you for your dedication and sowing the seed in Myanmar. So we are very, very grateful. Thank you again for Sister Jinglan's sharing. Now we move to the next section.